What's up, Wayne Baron here with darkfix.net and we are inside of Camtasia Studio 8 and I ran into an issue and I thought I'd bring it to everybody's attention, at least on how I corrected the issue. So let's go ahead and uh, import some media. We're going to import uh, these two WAV files right here. Go ahead and click on OK and we're going to drag it into our timeline. Hit our enter our uh, space key and we get this error right here. We're sorry, an error has occurred with the following clip on the timeline. The clip may not produce correctly. Now that is for both of these files. Both of them give the same exact error. That one right there does it as well. Now what I read on one of the forms was that uh, you remove all of the dashes. But as you can see this one right here has no dashes in it. And so I removed them out of that one. And how I found to fix this error was to actually convert the uh, audio over to mp3 format and so whenever you convert it over to mp3 format not only does it work but it really works as you can see we have our audio line right here and it's running just perfect so uh, yeah that's how I fixed the issue uh, other people did it by removing spaces underscores or what have you on different other types of files but in my issue it was a conversion from dot wave over to dot mp3 for some strange reason it doesn't seem like Camtasia Studio can run a dot wave now it could be the fact that my dot wave files are almost 500 megabytes in size whenever i convert them down to mp3 they drop down to 82 megabytes okay wayne baron here with darkfix.net oh yeah i also use total audio converter to convert it over so uh go check them out i have the link for that program in the description i believe they've got a trial version that y'all can try out as well y'all have a good one bye bye